free press believes that media must truly inform and engage our communities. But most media in the U.S. are failing to serve this vital role. Your support helps Free Press preserve and protect our right to communicate openly and independently. A dollar given to Free Press stretches out to cover a lot of ground. It multiplies, and it turns into people, real people who create opportunities for real change. How do we do it? We engage and mobilize hundreds of thousands of our members to take action. We organize meetings between our members and their representatives in Congress. We conduct our own research. We analyze thousands of pages of policy positions and communications data, and write hundreds of pages into the public record. We testify at hearings and defend our cases in court. We publicize our findings in the press. We don't back down in a fight. And we're winning. In 2011, Free Press won a series of unprecedented victories for the American people. We helped stop Congress from overturning the FCC's net neutrality rules. Our research and grassroots organizing moved the AT&T-T-Mobile merger from inevitable to impossible. We won our case in court against the FCC's attempt to weaken its ownership rules and allow big media companies to buy up even more local outlets. And we delivered more than one million petitions to the House and Senate to stop cuts aimed at destroying public broadcasting. And in the midst of all this, we held the fifth National Conference for Media Reform in Boston. It was quite a year, but we aren't resting on our laurels. In 2012, Free Press will continue the fight for media that works for people, not corporations. We'll remain undaunted by high-paid industry lobbyists. And we'll be mobilizing more people than ever for an open internet, strong public media, and diverse media ownership. Thank you so much for your support. You make all of this and so much more possible.